Amid Gaza ceasefire negotiations that have been underway since last week, U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken arrived in Tel Aviv on Sunday, marking his ninth trip to Israel since October 2023. Now, he's set to meet with Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu before heading to Egypt for ceasefire talks. Ian Jim reports. U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken arrived in the Israeli capital of Tel Aviv on Sunday with hopes of securing a Gaza ceasefire and hostage release deal. But just hours after landing, Hamas raised doubts over an agreement being reached. After two days of talks in Doha last week, the mediating countries, Qatar, the United States and Egypt, delivered the latest proposal to Hamas. The Palestinian group's response on Sunday was that the proposal was aligned with Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu's recent positions, saying that he refuses to end the war and withdraw Israeli forces from Gaza, including along the border with Egypt. Hamas reiterated that these were two conditions the group sees as the basis for any agreement, and said Netanyahu is responsible for thwarting the efforts of mediators by delaying the reaching of an agreement. Meanwhile, Netanyahu insists that pressure should be put on Hamas and not Israel, adding that the militant group did not send a delegation for ceasefire talks. Blinken is set to meet senior Israeli leaders, including the prime minister, on Monday. And following his meetings in Israel, Blinken will move on to Cairo for further talks in an effort to close the gap between Israel and Hamas to reach an agreement. Meanwhile, violence continued in Gaza on Sunday. Palestinian health authorities said Israeli airstrikes killed at least 21 people in Gaza, including six children. Ian Jin, Arirang News.